it's fun to give back. The psychic rewards for that are really significant and uh, you know how much do you need to be happy and I think uh, we're very comfortable and so you do what you can to help others. Well my philosophy goes back to my late mom who uh, basically was one who gave of her time. There wasn't much treasure in her life at that time but she believed you needed to give back and uh, I've been privileged to make a very good living in San Diego. This is our adopted community for Alexis and myself, and as such, uh, we want to give back to it. A higher education is, is a huge priority for us, so a higher education is one of the uh, foremost areas. And then after that, we pick organizations where we like the cause, like uh, Big Brothers Big Sisters, uh, Make-A-Wish Foundation, and really where we're impressed with the way the organizations are run. I think the business school uh, really needs a boost uh, and what does it need? It needs funds for scholarships, it needs funds for uh, needy kids, it needs money to help uh, attract and retain quality faculty and uh, we're doing it in the form of a challenge and uh, I figure if we reach the numbers I think we can reach in a relatively short time it will be a difference maker for the College of Business at San Diego State and that's what we want it to be. It's sort of a uh, an epiphany, uh, one of those events that, okay, it's a launching pad for greatness for the College of Business. Sometimes people get gifts and it's over and we can move on. In this particular instance, uh, they need to raise $50 million and we'll give them half of it and they've got to raise the other half. So uh, I think we'll get more community involvement, we'll get more people to support it, and it really it, it gets a greater group of people committed to the cause and I think that's what we're trying to do. You know, most of the people in business, in education, in a lot of areas in San Diego graduated from San Diego State. So how can it not be a critical part of what happens in San Diego over the next decade, generation, 50 years, 100 years? I feel very lucky. I've worked very hard in my life. Not everything has been golden, but on balance we've been very, very lucky and we're appreciative of that luck and I know a lot of people that work equally as hard who haven't had the opportunities we have and because of that we feel very good about giving back and I will tell you that giving something to someone else is more rewarding than maybe making it yourself. You see the smiles, you see the impact and uh, it, it's, it's what life's all about as far as I'm concerned.